Hey guys, it's Holly. It is very weird coming to you with a squishy package today because of what's going on in the world right now. I hope that everyone is okay. I hope that you are all safe and not freaking out. I think everyone's kind of freaking out a little bit. I really hope that everyone is just getting through this because we're gonna get through it. It's just, it's weird. This is weird. I don't know. I would now like to have a moment of memoriam for my colored hair. As you can tell, I am now back to my natural color. It has been three years of colors. I did pink, I did purple, pink, blue, I did all purple, I did a split, which was really fun, pastel pink, platinum blonde. It was a really good run, but I am now ready to take a break, to let my hair have a break. I've also chopped off quite a bit because the ends were completely fried. I'm just ready to not have to worry about doing my roots and upkeep and all of that. So yes, I hope you guys like it. I like it. It's very weird being back to normal and not being a pink unicorn. But you know what? I'm a pink unicorn on the inside, so that's all that matters. We are also going to be praying to the lipstick gods that I don't get lipstick on my teeth during this video. So this video is gonna be kind of a collab with Estrella. If you don't know Estrella, she is my best friend. She is a YouTuber as well as a squishy decoer. She has decoed probably thousands and thousands of squishies. She's designed squishies and she's just all around fantastic human being. But we both chose eight squishies from Mermaid Squish. So I'm gonna open mine. I don't know which ones she got. She posted a picture of one of them. So I know what one of them is, but we're basically gonna see how many squishies we both chose. I don't know how many I think that we're going to have picked the same. I'm gonna guess maybe half. That's gonna be my guess. So I guess that four squishies we picked the same. So we'll see if that's high or low. A big thank you to Mermaid Squish for sending me these. Make sure you follow them on Instagram and also go to their website, which is mermaidsquish.com. But let's go ahead and get started. So I just read the note they included in the package and they're actually doing a special promotion. So down below in the description, you will find a secret code and the first 10 customers to use that code will get 10% off of their order. The first one that I got is the Creamy Milk Bottle. Now, I don't know if this is going to spoil it, but all of these are eye bloom because pretty much eye bloom is my life right now. So this is a little blind bag. So let's see which one we got. It's wrapped up and we got, oh, it's so cute. It has the bunny and the fox. I don't know what the smell is supposed to be. This is the little pamphlet with all the ones that you can get. They're so cute, oh my God. I don't see the one that I got unless it's the mystery one. I think I got the mystery one. Oh, because it's rainbow. So I got the rainbow one, which is I guess the special random one over here in the corner. That's fun. Okay, well, this is really super cute. Oh, it's adorable. Oh, it's so cute and tiny, I love it. Not sure what the smell is supposed to be. I don't know if it's supposed to be milk scented. Does it smell bad? It just doesn't really smell super great either, but it's really cute. <gasps> oh my God, this is so cute. Okay, then I got the little teddy bear. Look how cute that is. Oh my God. Okay, so it's called Cutie Financier, and I'm not really sure what that means. I took a little bit of French in high school, but I don't know what financier, maybe? I don't know. <gasps> it's so cute. <laughs> Look at the little eyes. Oh my God, it smells like chocolate. It smells like the eye bloom Sasha Tort. And I think someone was saying that I was saying it wrong. I don't know how you say it. I don't know how to speak French, but it smells like chocolate. It smells really good. I'm not even a huge fan of chocolate, to be completely honest. I'm definitely more a vanilla person than a chocolate person. This makes me want to eat chocolate. And it smells, it smells like a brownie. Oh, I love it so much. Ooh, 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 and it feels like, it feels like the Sasha Tort. Sash Tort, I don't know how you say it. Sasha Tort. It's very like, it's fudgy because it's brown and it just feels like, like you know when you make brownies, it's like, almost like the fudgeness of it. Do you know what I'm talking about? And that is exactly what this is like and it's so nice and it smells so good. If you love brownies, please, please get at least one chocolate squishy from iBloom. I just think it's like chocolatey, but it smells like sweet. Oh, and this is so cute. Oh my God. 
I'm so excited for this right now. This is huge. This packaging is so, so pretty. So I don't remember how long ago this came out. I have, I've been kind of behind on the squishies, but this is really, really cute. So this is the, again, it's in French. The Bouche de Noël, I butchered that. I'm sorry that I can't speak French, okay? This is from Christmas time, but I don't care. I love the swirl and the colors and the strawberry. <gasps> Oh my God, I love it. <laughs> Ooh, it smells good. It smells like strawberry. Okay, here we go. Ah, yes. Look at the little strawberries. There's even little mushrooms. It says Merry Christmas. I love that this one is big. I think all pretty much all the other ones are kind of small. Okay, seriously, <gasps> look. <laughs> It is so, so squishy. I love it. It's so cute. How many times do I say cute in a video? Probably way too many. I need to think of more words. That one was magnificent. Oh, <laughs> it's all hedgehog. I'm so excited. This is the magical hedgehog. Oh my God. This one smells like mint. And I don't normally like the mint smell, the eye bloom mint smell, but I actually kind of like this for some reason. Is it different? I don't know what it is, but I actually really like this mint smell. Who am I? I don't know. <gasps> it's so cute. Okay, so I've been playing Animal Crossing, the new Animal Crossing game, New Horizons on the Switch. And this reminds me so much of like a villager. I haven't seen a hedgehog yet. Oh no, wait, there's a porcupine, which is the, the clothes lady. What's her name? Mabel, I think. But this is so cute. Look, it has little stars on his feet. The colors are so pretty. Oh my gosh. It does smell really good too. It's so weird. I don't normally like the mint smell. Love the colors. Would you like to come live on my island? Then next is this little donut. It's a little hamster donut. I love the I bloom hamster. Oh, it's so cute. It has little sprinkles. Even has like little tiny hands. <laughs> little tiny hamster hands. Ooh, it doesn't really have a smell. It's kind of like a very light bready smell i'm very very excited about this one okay this is i forget what it's called and it's all in japanese on the front but it's basically like a little gingerbread cookie house like a kawaii house oh my god look at it it has like character cookies on the side and there's a spoon and a fork and then there's a little window with characters in there. They're having a little party. <laughs> that is so cute. And then there's a little character here and there's chocolate on top. Oh my God. <gasps> it's so, so squishy. I feel like I'm just repeating myself over and over again. Every time I squish it, I'm like, <gasps> it's so squishy, it's so slow, but like they all are. I don't know what else to say about it. It's just really, really cute. All of the details on this thing though, like there's like Madeline cookies down here and they have like a texture and then the walls have like even like a little bit of shading to them. The roof has like a little heart pattern on it. Like the level of detail in this though. And then even just like the little picture of them in there, the window has like a little pane on it. Like what the heck? This is so nice. Even the bottom has like the shading going on. Uh, really, really, really nice. So I am very, very excited about this next one. This is the Bloom Faux Watch. Now, I don't know what Faux Watch means, but it's basically a Game Boy. And I grew up playing video games like Atari and then Super Nintendo, Nintendo 64, like a bunch of systems. And I remember having an original Game Boy, the kind that was like black and white. And I remember playing like Looney Tunes games and like all sorts of fun things, Mario, getting a Game Boy Color and just playing the crap out of it. And so I am just very like nostalgic for this little Game Boy right now. It's so cute. Okay, so it says start Foxy Fox over the rainbow. I guess that's the game. Oh my God, I love it so much. There's the little control pad and the little buttons. It's a star and a heart. Oh, I just wanna play it. <laughs> This is so cute. Like I am so happy about this because I have played my Game Boy for so long. Look, there's even batteries on the back. That's a cool detail. Wow. I just really like this one because it's like a little bit nerdy and I'm nerdy and I love it. 
and I wish this was a real game because I would totally play it. Like, look how cute. Like, can you imagine a game like that? Like a pixel game, especially too, like it's pixel. And I love pixel stuff. I think it kind of smells like blueberry, but I don't know if I'm making that up. It smells really good. But I just want to like, <laughs> I just want to like play it. I wish that they had made this the actual size of a Game Boy. Then next we have this one, which is like a little sandwich with the bunny in it and strawberries. Now, when we were in Japan at 7-Eleven, they had a ton of really, really good food. Like we got a lot of really good food at the 7-Eleven in Japan. And I recall them having sandwiches with fruit in it like this. This is so cute. Yeah, so basically it's like white, like plain white sliced bread and they just put cream in it and then strawberries. And it was really, really, really good. This cream though is beautiful. I love cream on squishies like that. It has a very subtle smell. It's a strawberry smell, but it's very light. This is so cute. I miss Japan so much. I wonder if I'll ever get to go there again. Ooh, it holds those hand crinkles really nice. I just want to eat it. Okay, lastly is this one, which is the little sheep in a cream puff. And this packaging is really, really cute. Oh my God, it's so adorable. It smells really good. I can't keep the smell straight anymore. It just smells really sweet. It's probably strawberry, but it also kind of has a blueberry smell. I honestly can't distinguish smells anymore. This is the little Sheraton sheep in a cream puff. Look at the little legs. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I don't know why that makes me laugh so much that his little legs are sprawled out behind him. I don't know what it is. It's like a little sploot, but it's so cute. And then it's very like shaded on top here. Very squishy. I love that they're incorporating the characters into food. Like I really love that a lot. Honestly, I feel like that's one of the reasons why I got into squishies in the first place was the ones that looked like food because I just really like fake food. So those are all eight squishies that I chose. So make sure that you go and check out Estrella's video to see how many we got similar. Make sure you follow her on Instagram. It's at Estrella Patron. I believe she did an Instagram TV video about her squishy package. A big thank you to Mermaid Squish for sending me these. Again, I will put the secret code down below in the description and the first 10 customers get 10% off of their order. So make sure you check that out. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope everyone stays safe, stay positive, keep yourself busy, don't go crazy. I love you all and I'll talk to you later. Bye.